come to ESHG. We're down here in Milan and it's a great opportunity for us to spend time with our customers and to listen. The relationship between Illumina and Genomics England is absolutely vital to us delivering the 100,000 Genomes project. We've worked really closely together on shared challenges and now we're past the 50,000 genome mark and we're looking forward to hitting 100,000 genomes. And without dealing with some of those shared challenges together across sequencing all the way through inter interpretation and sequence analysis, I don't think we'd have got as far as we have so fast. The collaboration with Lilium is really important because many labs are now implementing next-generation sequencing technologies and they'll standardise workflows. And as that builds and becomes more important day-to-day -to, -day to practice, then we need to be sure that those labs are producing data of the right quality uh, that's needed for their processes. In the next future, I imagine that our work will become more useful thanks to NGS. We will be more rapid, less expensive and complete. And to give to our cases and our families a really complete and definitive answer to their question. So in the future I expect within the next five years or so that genome sequencing will be the major uh, test. It will be uh, sequenced once, it will be questions in multiple ways, so and it will give multiple answers. A few years ago we didn't even think about uh, sequencing genomes or exomes and not even really you know, doing this panel sequencing. So what it changed is that we can globally look at genomes today, um, that we can use this information for clinical interpretation, one thing. Uh, the other thing really to find the genetic causes, in particular for rare diseases where I come from. Uh, but also we have a major effort right now to bring genomics into the clinic of personalized medicine.